I think it's really special because they're almost, they have to be done by hand. Tim Gearhart at Gearhart's Fine Chocolates, and Tim is going to share with us some of the secrets to blending boozy truffles. We're talking beer, we're talking wine, and whiskey. Whiskey truffles have been around a while, and but I have to tell you, it has been an absolute just revelation to us in the last uh, seeing people's reaction to something as simple as, as, a, as a whiskey truffle. Uh, Oma Gang is our first um, uh, brewery that we're starting to work with and um, we're working on a, uh, it's a it's a cherry ale chocolate. Absolutely. How do you make that balance work? Chocolate is a very powerful dominant uh, flavor profile. Um, wine is also a very dominant, especially red wine, is a very dominant flavor profile. When the two kind of come together it's a little too much. To me it's more about kind of playing off of each other and kind of accentuating what chocolate already is, you know, the smokiness, the, the, the red fruit, um, and the acidity. I like the kind of the mouth feel that alcohol brings. It really does um, change, it kind of changes um, how something melts in your mouth. Obviously you've got the, the different wines in the pot and vine selection, you've got the Rosetta Cherry Ale right. um, and the malt whiskey. Um, are there other sort of pairings that you're thinking about trying out? The more that we play around with um, beer and chocolate, the more you see that you know, obviously there's the low hanging fruit is the, the stouts and the dark chocolate. Sure. That makes perfect sense yeah. and it tastes great. But there is so much more um, out there that, um, you know, when you start talking about caramels and toffees with Hefeweizens and, and Saisons and all these kind of, you know, the herb kind of stuff. And, the, and then you throw in the uh, effervescence of beer, um, which is just a wonderful kind of a palate cleanser, natural palate cleanser. Um, it's just, it just, it's almost a better, frankly, don't, you know, I'll keep this kind of quiet, but it's in some <laughs> ways, beer and chocolate are almost better pairing than wine. Mm -hmm.